Hi guys, so we're gonna continue my evening routine with my morning routine today. I'm gonna share with you how I keep my hair in good shape for the five to seven days between washes. So this morning routine is universal for me. I do the same thing whether I'm wearing my hair in a wash and go, a twist down, a braid out, whatever I'm doing, the goal is to be able to style my hair quickly and easily after exercise because nine times out of 10, that's what I'm doing. So first thing in the morning, I wake up and style my hair in a way that allows me to hit the gym. And then after moisturizing, I don't take my hair down until I'm ready to go. I want the roots of my hair to dry as much as possible before I go. One, it keeps my hair stretched that way. Two, it prevents frizz. If I go out there with wet hair in Florida humidity, I will get frizz and shrinkage. And so the goal is to have my roots dry as much as humanly possible before I style my hair. So after a while, after I've eaten breakfast and after I've um, put on any makeup I'm gonna put on, I then go ahead and follow through with finishing my hair routine. Good morning. So I am gonna go ahead and take this down. I'm, I've already exercised and everything. And I'm gonna do my work, makeup, I think that's just lint or something um, I'm gonna do my work makeup and then I'll play with this it's been about 30 minutes since I put in the moisturizer um, so that's definitely dry I also wanted my roots to dry so that's why I left it way it was the way it was but now I'm just gonna do some quick work makeup and then I will shave my hair voila so all I do and this is actually Product interacting with my gray hair. It's kind of crazy. It's never happened. Um, <laughs> but all that I do is pull it into place. Um, I'm really focusing on separating the ends of my hair. I do not apply oil or anything. Uh, my hair is moisturized and the moisturizer has oils in it. And I just don't want to weigh my hair down with product either. You know, so this is just how I do it. And the little dent from the hair tie is gone. Just, you know, you just got to give it a moment. It didn't take me more than like eight minutes. Anyways, so this is all I do. And then my hair is ready for the day. Hey guys, it's the morning and if I'm not going to the gym, which I'm not this morning or running, this is how my hair looks. Now I'm gonna throw on some filming makeup to film and then leave my house. So how do I maintain my hair? Well, of course, first take that off and this is how my hair fared overnight. Not too bad, right? Take off the hair tie. I use one of the ribbon ties for this. Um, I find that I don't usually end up with hair in it. Like they, they tie it there. Um, and then I have my own hairdo. Use whatever milk fits your fancy. This is just the one that I have been using for a bit now for this. I take one full pump to moisturize my hair. And I just scrunch it in to my ends. And then because my crown is the driest portion of my hair, I also put it um, at the length of my hair there. And I just keep scrunching it in for a bit until I feel like it's like nice and everywhere and it's no longer on my hands it's all completely on my hair and then I'm gonna go ahead and do my makeup and I'm going to leave this like this until I finish my makeup um, because if I let it dry a little if I let that moisture my hair soak up that moisture then I don't get a bunch of frizz when I'm shaping it. So I'm gonna do my makeup and I'll be right back. Thought I was filming a second ago. But it fell on its own, so all I have to do now is just kinda of pull it into the shape I want. And that's it. 
make second day hair so easy and that's what I love about the wash and go. Um, if I just let my hair do what it naturally does, which you know, if I moisturize it, it's going to fall into the shape I put it in. And so all I have to do is finish pulling it, separate the ends like where the curls are so that I get a bit more fullness. And I can do all that without creating frizz if I moisturize my hair first, which, which, which is why I do that. And then I let it, my hair just kind of soak up that moisture before I shape it. And it did, it definitely did. I didn't use any water, so it doesn't take a long time. There was water in the product and I didn't add oil because I don't feel the need to add more weight, more product. There's oil in that product too. Um, and that's pretty much it. I'll probably keep playing with it until I leave the house. So that's this routine to get my hair into its shape and everything and it's perfect for doing the week and that's it that's my morning hair routine um this is what i've done for years and years and years continues to work for me so i'm gonna continue doing it and for any newbies here i like to moisturize my hair with hair milks and i do have a video going through my favorite hair milks that has not changed so i'll leave it linked above and below but i like to use hair milks because they're not too wet they're not too dry. They dry fairly quickly and easily on the hair and they leave the hair very moisturized. You do not have to moisturize your hair every day. Really every two to three days should be good. Every three days should be good. But I like to go above and beyond because one, I exercise a lot. Um, I exercise outside and that can kind of dry the hair out. Two, it's hella hot in Florida and that definitely dries the hair out. And three, I just like to do a little bit of overkill. Works for me. So in the comments box below, let me know how you keep your hair maintained throughout the week. I want to know. Tell me any products you use, any bonnets, whatever you do. I'd like to know. Let me know how simple or how complicated it is. And until next time, check me out on Patreon, Instagram, Facebook, and the blog. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.